daily devotionals for March 10th. Today's scripture reading will be Exodus 14, verses 18 through 20. Then the Egyptians shall know that I am the Lord, when I have gained honor for myself over Pharaoh, his chariots, and his horsemen. You know, that all speaks of power and authority, okay? And the angel of God, or you could say the angel of his presence, who went before the camp of Israel, moved and went behind them. And the pillar of cloud went from before them and stood behind them. So it came between the camp of the Egyptians and the camp of Israel. Thus it was a cloud and darkness to the one, and it gave light by night to the other, so that one did not come near the other all that night. Now that is amazing. You know, God didn't need to prove that he was God, but the people, Pharaoh and the people, his men and, and the Egyptians in general, their hearts were so hard and they did not know God, okay? They worshiped other gods. Think about things in the world today. There are so many little gods, you know, we put idols ahead of us and really worship that instead of God. And what am I saying? Are, are we bowing down, you know, and, and honoring, you know, giving praise and glory to these other gods? No, it's not that we do that, but it's really anything that we lift up above God. What do we spend most of our time doing? You know, is it internet? Is it entertainment? Uh, you know, there's so many different things. You know, we can make so many things an idol in our heart, which really becomes like a, a stone God to us. So God is saying here, he's going to send that, that pillar of fire that went before them to guide them in the cloud that covered them by day to give them darkness from the, the sun. He was now bringing that behind them. So between the Israelites and the Egyptians, when they're going through the uh, Red Sea, both of that, the pillar and the cloud, would, would block them, would stand between them. So it would give light to the Israelites so they could, the children of Israel could go through the Red Sea. This was an all night, how many millions of people there were, you know, to get through there. And yet it would be uh, that pillar of fire to keep them, the other ones, you know, one would be darkness and one would be light. It would keep them totally separated. And the uh, Egyptians couldn't go, they couldn't move. They could go so far, thus far and no more. So they were blocked and they could not reach the children of Israel. And he was showing them who he was. So, uh, you know, this was an all night process, but he will do that with us too. He will run interference for us. It's gonna look like everything is just dark, like nothing's going my way you know god i cried out to you why aren't you answering me where are you and all the time he is putting up blockers opposition things to keep the enemy at bay so to speak while he's opening up the door on the other side for you so that's why it's important we stand still and wait on him and watch and move when he tells us to not to go ahead of him because sometimes you go ahead of god then you're going to be really agreeing with the enemy and not to lack behind, but to be right in uh, the right movement with him, okay? Okay, I think we're going to wrap this up tomorrow, so till then, be blessed.